let's now discuss some simple problems based on the concept of gradient and a directional derivative initially let's find out gradient of r to the power of n what is this r if r bar represents general position vector of a particle moving in space or if r bar is xi bar plus yj bar plus zk bar then r denotes the magnitude of this that means r is same as square root of x square plus y square plus z square what is gradient of r to the power of n it is in fact n r to the power of n minus 2 into r bar how are you going to arrive at this we know that gradient of a function is i bar dou by dou x of the function plus j bar dou by dou y of the function plus k bar dou by dou z of the function let us consider dou by dou x of r to the power of n dou by dou x of r to the power of n means dou by dou x of x square plus y square plus z square to the power of n by 2 using fundamental derivative concept it is n by 2 x square plus y square plus z square to the power of n minus 2 by 2 of course multiply it by derivative of the quantity within parenthesis that is 2x we can as well see it as n x into r to the power of n minus 2 by symmetry of the expression of r we can write dou by dou y of r to the power of n is n into y into r to the power of n minus 2 dou by dou z of r to the power of n is n z r to the power of n minus 2 therefore gradient of r to the power of n is equal to i bar dou by dou x of r to the power of n plus j bar dou by dou y of r to the power of n plus k bar dou by dou z of r to the power of n or substituting for the partial derivatives we get i bar into n x r to the power of n minus 2 plus j bar into n y r to the power of n minus 2 plus k bar into n z r to the power of n minus 2 or taking certain quantities common you can observe it as n r to the power of n minus 2 r bar next let us consider another simple problem that is what is gradient of 1 by r actually substituting n is equal to minus 1 in the previous problem you can get it as minus r bar by r cube let's work out the same from fundamentals if r bar is the position vector of a point in space then r bar is xi bar plus yj bar plus zk bar there is a convention to write either capital r bar or small r bar to denote this position vector then r square its magnitude square or square of the magnitude will be x square plus y square plus z square in the fundamental definition of gradient of 1 by r we have got dou by dou x of 1 by r dou by dou y of 1 by r dou by dou z of 1 by r let's directly write down the derivatives so that gradient of 1 by r becomes i bar into minus 1 by 2 x square plus y square plus z square to the power minus 3 by 2 into 2x plus j bar into minus 1 by 2 x square plus y square plus z square to the power minus 3 by 2 into 2y plus k bar into minus 1 by 2 x square plus y square plus z square to the power minus 3 by 2 into 2z or you can take out certain quantities common we can observe it as minus 1 by 2 into x square plus y square plus z square to the power minus 3 by 2 
into two times x i bar plus y j bar plus z k bar. Now it is same as minus r cube into r bar r minus r bar by r cube. Similarly, we can find out gradient of any other power of r. The third problem of this unit to find a unit vector normal to the surface x cube plus y cube plus 3xyz is equal to 3 at the point 1 comma 2 comma minus 1 and also the maximum rate of change of the function x cube plus y cube plus 3xyz minus 3 at the same point that is 1 comma 2 comma minus 1. We know that grad f gives the maximum rate normal to the surface and then magnitude of grad f gives maximum rate of change of the function. So let us take f is equal to x cube plus y cube plus 3xyz minus 3 so that the surface becomes or surface can be represented by f is equal to 0. Now the normal to the surface is grad f is equal to i bar dou f by dou x plus j bar dou f by dou y plus k bar dou f by dou z is equal to i bar into 3x square plus 3yz plus j bar into 3y square plus 3xz plus k bar into 3xy. Now the normal is grad f at 1 comma 2 comma minus 1. So substituting x is equal to 1, y is equal to 2 and z is equal to minus 1 in the earlier expression we get grad f is minus 3i bar plus 9j bar plus 6k bar. We know how to obtain the unit vector. Gradient is to be divided by its magnitude. So unit vector, unit normal vector to the surface at 1 comma 2 comma minus 1 is grad f evaluated at the point divided by its magnitude evaluated at 1 comma 2 comma minus 1. So it is minus 3i bar plus 9j bar plus 6k bar divided by square root of 3 square plus 9 square plus 36 is or it becomes minus 3i bar plus 9j bar plus 6k bar divided by root of 126. Now what is the maximum rate of change of the function? It is magnitude of grad f evaluated at 1 comma 2 comma minus 1 that means it is square root of 126.